looks like chaos, but there's always somebody behind the wheel. The mission of the vault should be important to everyone. Fallout's first season finale explodes with revelations about the war, Vault Fix's true motives, and the characters' destinies. Let's delve into the wasteland chaos, the bombshell, Vault Tech's devious plot. The season dismantles a long-held belief. China wasn't solely responsible for the nuclear war. A shocking flashback reveals a pre-war ghoul, Cooper, witnessing a meeting where Vault Tech executives, likely part of the pre-war enclave, orchestrate the atomic bombings. Vault Tech, entrusted with humanity's survival, became its destroyer. Lucy's world shatters. A father's betrayal. Lucy's search for her father, Hank, takes a dark turn. We discover Hank wasn't a vault dweller, but a high-ranking vault tech employee before the war. Worse, he played a role in the bombings and the destruction of Shady Sands, the community built by Lucy's mother, Rose. This revelation forces Lucy to confront the truth about her father and the warped ideology of vault tech A glimmer of hope and a deadly sacrifice. Raider leader Moldover acquires cold fusion technology a potential game-changer for the wasteland. However, the Brotherhood of Steel attacks, leaving her mortally wounded. Despite this, Moldova activates the reactor, bathing a devastated Los Angeles in light for the first time in centuries. While a bittersweet victory, it offers hope for a future powered by clean energy. Maximus' ascension and uncertain future. Maximus, the aspiring Brotherhood Knight, gets an unexpected promotion after being mistaken for Moldova's killer. Though achieving his dream rank, his true desire lies in a life outside the Brotherhood with Lucy. However, his newfound knowledge of Hank's treachery adds another layer of complexity to their relationship. Lucy and Cooper, an uneasy alliance throughout the series, Lucy and Cooper, the ghoul bounty hunter, haven't seen eye to eye, but necessity forges an unlikely alliance. Cooper's true motive for seeking the cold fusion tech isn't money, but information on cryogenically frozen vault tech personnel. His wife and daughter might still be alive, preserved before the bombs fell. This shared pursuit of answers unites them in their pursuit of Hank. Vault 33 A Stark Underbelly Back in Vault 33, Lucy's brother Norm uncovers a disturbing secret. The residents of neighboring Vault 32, presumed killed by raiders, met a gruesome end through internal violence. This raises questions about the psychological experiments Vault Tech conducted on its vault dwellers. Norm also discovers the shocking truth. Vault 31 is controlled by a disembodied brain housed in a robotic vacuum cleaner. He's trapped by this macabre overseer, leaving him with a mind-blowing secret to share. A new threat emerges. The allure of New Vegas. Hank, fleeing his past, stumbles upon a deathclaw skull, a wasteland predator known for its ferocity. This encounter foreshadows the dangers that may lie ahead, but the most significant aspect of his journey is his destination. New Vegas a legendary fallout locale. This iconic city, teeming with potential allies and enemies, sets the stage for a thrilling season two. Fallout's season finale leaves us with a world reshaped by vault Tech's treachery. Lucy faces a future filled with anger and the need for answers. Maximus grapples with newfound power and his yearning for a life outside the rigid brotherhood structure. Cooper seeks redemption and a chance at reuniting with his family, and the wasteland itself holds new dangers and opportunities in the form of New Vegas. Season 2 promises to be a wild ride through a world teetering on the brink of a brighter future or a descent into further chaos. Fallout's season finale throws a nuclear bomb, figuratively, of course, at everything we thought we knew. The biggest shocker, China wasn't solely responsible for the Great War. Instead, it was Vault Tech, the very company tasked with humanity's survival, who orchestrated the entire event. Driven by a twisted sense of control, Vault Tech executives nuked the world, then cryogenically froze themselves to wait out the apocalypse. Their plan, to return later and rule over a better civilization built in their image. This revelation shatters the trust vault dwellers had in their supposed saviors, exposing a legacy of lies and manipulation. But there's a glimmer of hope. Dr. Wilzig, a scientist who knew of vault tech's evil, smuggled out vital cold fusion technology before the bombs fell. This clean energy source has the potential to revolutionize the wasteland offering a path to peace and prosperity. Lucy, unknowingly, becomes the key when she delivers this artifact to Moldova, who uses it to activate a cold fusion reactor. For the first time in centuries, a devastated Los Angeles lights up, a symbol of potential rebirth. However, this newfound hope comes with a new threat. The Brotherhood of Steel, led by a now-promoted Maximus, 
controls the observatory housing the reactor, will they use this power for the good of the wasteland? Or will they succumb to the same lust for control that plagued Vault Tech? Meanwhile, the first for vengeance burns brightly in the ghoul, who is actually pre war Vault Tech mascot Cooper. He knows Vault Tech is behind all the suffering and is determined to expose the mastermind pulling the strings. He believes Hank, Lucy's father, and a high ranking Vault Tech executive will lead him to this puppet master. Hank, however, is running from his past. His journey takes him to a legendary location from the Fallout video games. New Vegas. This throws the series into uncharted territory. Unlike the original setting, New Vegas' future is shaped by player choices in the video game, leaving us with a world full of possibilities and unknowns. The season ends on a tense cliffhanger. The battle for control, this time over clean energy, is about to erupt. Who will wield this power? The Brotherhood of Steel, the New California Republic, a major faction hinted at in the show or some unseen force yet to be revealed. Fallout's finale rewrites history, exposes a monstrous corporation, and sets the stage for a thrilling season two in the iconic New Vegas, a world brimming with both hope and intrigue.